Since April 2024, Russia has reportedly increased its use of Shahid-136 drones, now allegedly equipped with TBBCH-50 thermobaric warheads, according to Ukrainian officials. These drones, which have become a significant tool in the ongoing conflict, are specifically designed to target and destroy fortified military positions, making them an even more dangerous weapon on the battlefield. Thermobaric warheads, also known as fuel air explosives, are highly effective in confined spaces. They create a high-temperature explosive cloud that penetrates multiple layers of a building or bunker. This cloud produces a massive shockwave, causing severe internal injuries to anyone caught in its blast. The TBBCH-50 warhead, weighing 52.4 kilograms, combines thermobaric effects with fragmentation, containing over 2,300 steel shrapnel elements. The result is an explosion capable of destroying personnel and equipment inside heavily fortified structures. The Shahid-136, originally developed by Iran, is a loitering suicide drone with a range of up to 2,500 kilometers. Known for its precision targeting capabilities, it can be deployed in swarms, launching multiple drones simultaneously from trucks to overwhelm and strike various targets. Russia began using these drones in 2022, rebranding them as Garin-2. Production has since ramped up, with modifications made to simplify assembly and reduce costs. These changes have led to increased manufacturing volume, with reports suggesting that Russia is now producing thousands of these drones annually. The integration of the TBBCH-50 thermobaric warhead into the Shahid-136 significantly enhances its destructive power, making it capable of penetrating deep into enemy defenses. The warhead's shockwave, combined with its intense fire cloud, can cause catastrophic damage to Ukrainian military positions, particularly those located in bunkers or other fortified structures. As of September 2024, Russia has met its production goals for the Shahid-136, with some estimates predicting that peak production could reach up to 800 units per month. This rapid increase in drone production is expected to further intensify the conflict, giving Russia a consistent supply of highly lethal weapons. However, production still relies heavily on the availability of components, particularly from Chinese suppliers. The use of Shahid-136 drones with thermobaric warheads is a clear escalation in the conflict, as these weapons can cause widespread destruction. Their effectiveness against entrenched military positions presents a significant challenge to Ukrainian forces, weakening their ability to defend key infrastructure. The potential for further escalation is high, as the introduction of these advanced munitions could shift the balance of power on the battlefield. As the war progresses, the use of Shahid-136 drones equipped with thermobaric warheads may become one of the most effective weapons in Russia's arsenal. The devastating power of these drones raises serious concerns about the future of the conflict and the impact on civilian populations. With each new wave of attacks, the situation in Ukraine grows more dire, as the destructive potential of these drones is fully realized.